Hello, I'm Sarah Gallagher. I'm an instructional designer at Triton College. And today I'm gonna to take you through setting up your microphone in Collaborate Ultra. We'll also demonstrate two other ways that you can communicate. These ways will work no matter what role that you've been assigned. So you can use it as a presenter, a participant, or a moderator. Let's get started. First, we're gonna look at the bottom of our screen. And at the bottom, this is referred to the interaction bar. This very first bubble is, uh, with the little bubble person, is my settings. And then we have the audio, next is the video, and finally the raised hand. Let's look at the audio. So in order to share audio, you'll need to click on button. All of these icons with the white outline means that those functions are currently are not enabled. So in order to share audio, we'll have to click on it to enable our microphone. And it presses. Now it looks like that microphone has been set up, which means everyone in the session should be able to hear me. Sometimes it's not quite that simple. So let's go on to the next step to verify that we will have the uh, best quality that we can. I'm gonna turn it off for a moment. Um, and there's two ways of doing an audio check, or at least two ways. One of them is you can click on my settings, that little bubble person. And you'll have this panel open up to the side that says my settings. You'll notice that the little gear in the lower right hand corner is in this purple, which means that is the tab that has been selected. So we'll go to the top and select audio and video settings. It was already selected. <laughs> then we set up your camera and microphone. Let's click on that. And notice, according to this, I have our great audio, which is phenomenal. But sometimes our devices have multiple input devices, so multiple ways our microphone can be accessed through multiple microphones. For instance, a laptop might have a built-in microphone, but you may be trying to use your headset. So just to verify it's working, instead of selecting default, we'll want to select the actual device that you want to use. In this case, it is my headset microphone is a Logitech, so I'm going to select that. I still have a great sound, which is phenomenal. So I can click, yes, it's working. We're not going to do the video test today, but if you do have a camera and you'd like to use it, just follow the instructions. It's very similar to the audio setup. But I'm going to go ahead and skip it this time. Now it looks like my microphone is set up. It's telling me I'm good to go. Note uh, that it's still in this yellow, um, yellow, uh, white, my apologies, a white outline, which means it's currently not active. So in order for me to speak to others, I'd actually have to click on it. And now my microphone is on. When I drag my mouse across it, now it tells me I can mute it. So I can mute my microphone. It's always good practice that if you're not speaking to go ahead and mute your microphone. So that's setting up your microphone. Now you can also chat. Um, so let's say you just wanted to do a quick response or you're having problems with your microphone. Um, again, to the right-hand side of the screen, there's that little open chat icon. It looks like a little thought bubble, talking bubble. And then you can just type in your message. Uh, one thing to note here is that if uh, you type in a message and then someone enters the session and joins Collaborate Ultra, they won't see what was previously typed. So if you're writing a hello message, every time someone enters, you'll need to write hello. So that is our chat. Uh, let me close this out really quick so I can show you something. If I close this out, lower right hand corner, close out the Collaborate panel. You can also open up the Collaborate panel to access the chat. Or, as I initially did, you can click in the interaction bar, My Settings, and you'll also have the opportunity to click on Chat. The last thing I wanted to show you is setting up your, if you wanted to use a telephone, click on My Settings, either from the interaction bar or the Collaborate panel. And then you'll see under Audio and Video Settings, there's Use Your Phone Audio. So I click on that. It's going to give me a phone number and a PIN. Uh, please note that this phone is a long distance phone call. So use the phone number and the pin and that's your last option. Okay, that's all we have for today. I hope you really enjoy your Collaborate Ulster session. Thank you.